Y'all ready? It's getting heavy. Heavy on me. It's getting heavy. Heavy on me. So can you help me? Yeah. Hey, what's up? This is PJ Morton, and you're behind the scenes of my Yamaha All Access photo shoot. Let me check it out. New Orleans, you know, I was kind of blessed to be raised there, you know, because music is such a huge part of it. It just was just the perfect foundation for me. Uh, as well as my family being, my dad was a pastor, but he was also a, a, an amazing singer, he is an amazing singer. So I got my start playing in my dad's church and singing in my dad's church and also playing around town in New Orleans. So there was so much music. I started playing the House of Blues. Uh, Sunday brunch when I was 14, so it was just a lot, a lot there for me to soak up. So uh, there was the gospel music there in New Orleans. That was kind of the lowest hanging fruit for me and all that I really knew growing up there. Gospel music is so much about call and response. You sing something and you want to make them feel what you're saying. So I learned that. I'll never let go of that, but it's lyrical content. It kind of, you kind of talk about one thing, you know. And I knew that, you know, I wanted to talk about life. I wanted to talk about love. I want to talk about God if I want to, you know what I mean? But not limited to that. Um, so it was, it was clear for me. I knew that this is not all I want to say, you know. So I left and went to Atlanta, went to Morehouse College, and that's when I um, got into mainstream music, worked uh, with this artist, Andy Ari, and from there, it just started to go. Uh, two years ago, I was actually grinding out as an independent musician with my own music for a while, and I was on a tour of my own and got a call from a friend of mine, Adam Blackstone, who's um, a great music director. He called me and said, hey man, I just got this Maroon 5 gig. They're looking for uh, another uh, keyboard player slash background vocalist, um, and I recommended you. So they flew me to LA, and then just the vibe was so cool that we just jammed for a long time. And the rest is history. Like it's been two years now uh, with me being with the band, and um, it's been amazing. We just worked on a new record, and we've toured the world. You know, it's been amazing working with those guys. This motif, uh, it just it just sounds really good. I think uh, it's the closest to date of authentic whatever. You know, like the Wurlitzer is something that I use a lot. And it just, it's really close. You know, it's authentic, it's very warm. And you know, it's like the centerpiece of my show. So uh, super uh, XF8 Pro, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm all for it, I love it. Yeah. Hey guys, I appreciate you watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope to see you soon. Peace.